The James Webb Space Telescope gazes so profoundly into the universe that it detects light, which has been journeying through space for over 13 billion years. As the cosmos has continually expanded, that primordial light has elongated accordingly. When we observe the most distant galaxies, we are essentially witnessing the past almost to the very instant of the Big Bang. Although the scale of the universe seems endless, every region of it originated from what is commonly known as the singularity. This notion currently represents our understanding of the Big Bang hypothesis. Nonetheless, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has unveiled extraordinary discoveries about the origin and evolution of the cosmos, leaving even experienced scientists astonished. Renowned physicist Brian Cox has remarked that the revolutionary findings from the JWST could profoundly alter our comprehension of the universe as a cohesive whole. These astronomical insights may transform our knowledge. Named after former NASA Administrator James E. Webb, the JWST is a technological wonder of modern space science. It signifies a substantial leap forward compared to its predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope. Developed through a joint venture involving NASA, the European Space Agency ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency CSA, and outperforming its forerunner, the JWST integrates state-of-the-art technology and a specialized design crafted to capture the universe in exceptional clarity. In contrast to Hubble, the JWST produces sharp, high-definition visuals of remote celestial objects operating primarily in the infrared range. This distinct ability allows it to pierce through interstellar dust and unveil cosmic events that were formerly concealed. Its massive 6.5-meter main mirror constructed from 18 hexagonal panels, is significantly larger than Hubble's. Stationed around 1.5 million kilometers from Earth at the second Lagrange point L2, the telescope follows the Sun's orbit in tandem, with Earth ensuring a consistent and uninterrupted view of space. Looking into far-off regions of the universe, it's not only a matter of distance, it's a form of temporal exploration. The JWST's infrared instruments empower researchers to observe celestial bodies and cosmic events that trace back billions of years. As the universe stretches, light from these ancient sources experiences redshift, shifting from visible light to the infrared spectrum. Fortunately, the JWST is capable of capturing this shifted light, enabling scientists to investigate star formation, study galactic development, and examine the atmospheres of planets outside our solar system. One of its most mind-blowing findings is the detection of an enormous galaxy cluster at the outer edge of the observable universe. This observation contradicts long-standing beliefs about early cosmic evolution and forces scientists to reassess core principles of cosmology. To fully appreciate this scientific breakthrough, it's beneficial to reflect on the history of astronomy. Ancient societies like the Greeks and Chinese laid essential groundwork by tracking the movement of planets. In the 17th century, Newton's laws established a conceptual structure for grasping gravity and orbital dynamics. During the early 20th century, astronomer Edwin Hubble made pivotal contributions. His work demonstrated that what were thought to be distant nebulae were actually external galaxies reshaping our view of the universe's scale and expansion. Hubble's law confirmed that galaxies farther away are moving away more rapidly, providing strong proof of cosmic inflation. Post-World War II, the space race took off with the 1957 launch of Sputnik, followed by Yuri Gagarin's groundbreaking orbit in 1961 and the 1969 Apollo 11 moon landing remarkable feats in space travel. The 1990 deployment of the Hubble Space Telescope HST marked a new chapter, offering never-before-seen imagery and data about the universe. The journey from ancient stargazing to the modern engineering feat represented by the JWST illustrates humanity's persistent quest for cosmic understanding. The HST captured legendary images like the Pillars of Creation in the Eagle Nebula, displaying star-forming regions within towering clouds of gas and dust. Another milestone, the Hubble Deep Field, 
revealed countless galaxies in what once appeared to be an empty portion of the sky. Hubble also contributed to the study of exoplanet atmospheres, detecting elements like water and organic substances, hinting at the possibility of life beyond Earth. Its observations of supernova S and 1987A provided crucial information about the lifespan of giant stars. These achievements cemented the telescope's role in the field of astronomy. Its successor, the JWST, was created to further push the boundaries, especially in investigating the universe's beginnings. The dominant theory suggests the cosmos originated from a super hot, dense singularity that expanded rapidly, an event thought to have occurred roughly 13. 8 billion years ago, as it grew, it gave rise to matter, energy, and fundamental forces. Over time, as it cooled, it led to the development of atoms, stars, galaxies, and the large-scale formations we see today. The Big Bang Theory also explains cosmic microwave background radiation, elemental distribution, and the grand structure of the cosmos. Although widely endorsed, the model initially faced resistance. Alternative theories such as the steady-state model argued for an eternal, unchanging universe. Skepticism over the singularity, expansion, and early inconsistencies was common. With time, most of these doubts were resolved, especially after the 1965 discovery of cosmic microwave background CMB radiation, which greatly reinforced Big Bang forecasts. Later missions like COBE and WMAP provided even finer data, validating the theory with exceptional precision. Enter the JWST, fitted with advanced infrared sensors that cut through interstellar clouds. It permits researchers to view the first light ever emitted. These tools allow scientists to examine stellar nurseries, detect stars hidden to optical, observatories like Hubble, and concentrate on regions where stars are forming. Since infrared light travels in longer wavelengths, it penetrates space dust, exposing previously unseen parts of the cosmos. The JWST is also particularly effective at studying cooler astronomical bodies, including brown dwarfs, distant galaxies, and potentially life-supporting exoplanets. As galaxies move away, their light becomes redshifted, and the JWST sensors detect these signals offering insights into the earliest epochs of the universe. Dramatic events like black hole mergers and stellar births often emit infrared radiation. As such, the JWST not only complements visual telescopes, but greatly surpasses them by illuminating previously inaccessible dimensions of space. Recently, it revealed something truly remarkable, gigantic galactic formations existing just a few hundred million years post Big Bang. These early galaxies, visible during the cosmic dawn, appear larger and more mature than existing models predicted. This implies that galaxy development in the infant universe may have been more rapid and chaotic than we anticipated. Such revelations are significant. They disrupt current theories and imply the existence of unknown processes or conditions in the universe's infancy. The JWST's findings are pushing cosmologists to update or fine-tune their models, especially concerning structure development and galactic growth. The number and complexity of these early galaxies also challenge assumptions. Many show advanced features that contradict the idea of gradual growth. Instead, we might be witnessing swift, large-scale evolution pointing to a denser, more intricate cosmic network than we previously imagined. Gaps between theoretical predictions and observational data have triggered intense debates in the scientific world. How did such massive structures emerge so rapidly without defying the laws of physics? Are there still unidentified forces or mechanisms influencing cosmic evolution? The answer likely lies in ongoing exploration and deeper examination. In space science, first observations frequently yield surprises. Further scrutiny often uncovers more nuanced galactic architecture, chemical variation, and stellar patterns than initial models anticipated, spectroscopy, analyzing light to determine. A celestial object's properties plays a vital role. It unveils data about composition, temperature, density, and motion, 
offering a detailed look into how stars and galaxies evolve over time. The JWST has already shown that early interpretations can be misleading, where earlier research suggested primitive galaxies filled only with hydrogen and helium, new spectroscopic findings reveal heavier elements and unexpected substances, challenging our beliefs about early cosmic chemistry and material spread. Similar surprises have emerged in how galaxies evolve. What was once thought to follow a uniform blueprint is now seen far more varied and complex. This points to a much more diverse early universe than once theorized. Lastly, one of JWST's most thrilling capabilities is its power to scrutinize exoplanet atmospheres in depth. By examining starlight that passes through these planetary skies, the telescope can identify key chemicals like water vapor, methane, carbon dioxide, and organic compounds all of which could signal the presence of life. Additionally, the JWST is reshaping our understanding of star birth. It can look through gas and dust to directly observe the formation of stars, giving clearer insight into how systems like our own solar system were formed. This aids us in piecing together the path from cosmic dust to potentially habitable planets.